dying woman. <laughs> Very pretty. So you, what's your name? For you, my name is Death. Death. Bad luck, I'm immortal. Ah. You're beautiful when you're angry. But I'm sure you're even more beautiful when you love. What could you understand about love? You're a Roman. They're all uncivilized like you. What are you in Rome? The king. Ah. And what is Rome, anyway? A people? A nation? At this moment, it's a simple village. It's the first grain of the harvest which will one day cover the earth. That is, if gods will listen to me and the people obey me. You're handsome. If I should listen, would you take me back to Rome? Ah, not yet. We have no women in Rome. You'd be one against 1,000 men, 1,000 wolves with very sharp teeth. One doesn't touch the wife of the king. One can touch his widow. It only takes one stroke with a sword in Rome. They don't like you? They'll like you even more. What do you want me to do, then? To wait. <laughs> I'm not good at waiting. You'll learn. What is your name? Romulus. All right, I agree to wait, Romulus. But I won't wait forever, I promise you that. My name is Duja. In the Phoenician tongue, Duja is the one who returns. You must remember that. She's gone. This is no life. You can't even meet a woman. And to think that back in my country, I had all I wanted. There's an abandoned cave on the slope of the hill, or you won't have any trouble finding it. I'll bring the women's clothes. You visit me often? Every night. Kings become human beings at night. <laughs> and I'll be queen one day. Well, uh, first we'd have to get approval from my father. Who is your father? Mars. The God of War. I'm not afraid of him. The God of War. Haven't we to fear someone else from now on? The God of Love. 